The Wooded Railway Originals of Thomas and Friends, Episode 99, Patriot Squeak, Rattle and Roll. On the island of Silver, there's a foreign entry called Patriot. When Patriot was first brought to the island, he met up with Gordon and Doc. And they were arguing about what the station was in London. And they were still arguing until the engine went back to the mainland. And then, 14 years later, he came back to the island, and, and he was now, and he worked hard on the island of Sobo, or, and he was now purchased by Sir Stephen Topham Hatt. Meanwhile, Patriot had just finished taking a passenger train to Nafford Harbor, but suddenly, the you was in his way. Excuse me, said Patriot. Express train coming through. Daniel had to go on to the other line. You steamies are old and flecked out. When Sir Topham Hat realizes this, you'll all be scrapped. Scrapped? said Patriot. I'm as best as I ever was. And he steamed away. When I was Patriot was about to steam into Nefford Station, he heard a squeaking noise. It was coming from his wheels. Bust my buffers, said Patriot. Daniel was right. I'm pulling apart. As he uncoupled from his coaches, he went back to the sheds. As he arrived, the Topham hat was waiting for, for him. Patriot, said Sir Topham hat, I need you. Take a passenger train from Vickers Town back to Nefford Harbor. Um, yes, sir, said Patriot nervously, but he didn't want to tell Sir Topham Hen about his, his squeaky wheel. The next morning, Patriot waited until the engines were to work. As soon as they left, Patriot seemed to wait to to collect his coaches. As soon as Patriot had collected the, the passengers at Vickers Town, he steamed away to Nafford Harbor. But he went slowly. The passengers were cross. What are you doing, Patriot? They said. Uh, why are you, you going around? I'm trying to not let anyone hear my squeaky wheels. Oh, remember, said, said Patriot's driver. It, in the, in the, one of the, the, that's this, this engine's on the island, like Gordon. That made Patriot feel much better. as he could, and he had a rattle. And that is he went over the viaduct to hear the knock. Bust my buffers, or said Patriot, but he didn't care. He went down the viaduct towards the harbor. As Patriot arrived at Nafford Harbor, 
Frida and Frank were surprised. They never heard an engine make such awful noises. Sounds like a steam engine ready to be taken to the scrap yards, said Daniel. But Atria didn't care about Daniel. He was pleased that he got um, um, passengers just to Nefert Harbor on time. Well done. Atria just has to tell him that. Well, why weren't you, um, didn't you, you go to the repair yard to get your wheels oiled? The repair yard, said Patriot. Yeah, I thought you were going to scrap me. Scrap you, said Sir Topham Hat. I would never do that. Yeah. 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 You know you useful, one of the usefulest engines on the island. Thank you, sir, said Patriot. Patriot came back from the works. Back from the repair yard. He it was a good working order. And if and if his wheel wheels leak again, he would all please go to the repair yard and get his wheels oiled for the time being.